What do you have to do to succeed as a man in today's world, right? I, we were talking about it before, but like I think the number one thing is physical fitness. You got to be physically fit, right? You got to be taking care of your body. I'm not talking about being a bodybuilder or being strong and muscle bound, but you need to be physically capable. You, you, you need to not be physically tired all day long because life is hard enough, right? Yeah. You're going to get a lot of stuff thrown at you. You know, you need to be financially able to handle yourself. You yeah, know? and um, financial financial literate. Right. And I'm not talking about being rich, but I mean not taking on tons of debt, not taking on forget, not buying tons of material possessions, you know, focusing on things that are going to get you moving forward in life and investing your money in those things um, and, and not wasting it on trash. And then the third thing, and I think this is a really big one that we're really screwing up, is avoiding distractions that are going to take you away from those things, right? So, like, pornography, it's a huge thing, right? And I, I watch porn. I'm not going to act like I don't. It's but getting like, bad. I'm getting, it's, it's everywhere, fucking, it's bro. Fucking, it's too easy, bro. Yeah, dude, it's you open up Instagram right now, everything's porn. You know, oh, right? I can't, I mean, And it's not actual porn, but it's girls, like, marketing their fucking shit. Porn sites, so there's girls, and you click on their profile, and then they have a link to their porn site, and it's just right. like, fuck, right. man. I'm a goddamn grown ass adult with life experience, done all kinds of things, and it's hard for me. What is it for a sixteen yeah. year old, thirteen Dude. through seventeen year old? How can you even get anything done, bro? If I had, if I was, if they, they had the access to porn that they have now when I was fourteen, I don't think I fucking would have left my bedroom. Bro. That's what I'm saying. What desire do they gonna have to even want to go get girls when they can just see the best girls of their dreams do whatever they want, right. like? Yeah, dog. I think the porn kind of messes up your brain, dog. It kind of messes up your brain for sex too, because it makes like unrealistic, real, real yeah. it makes unrealistic um, things. You know, well, they like, say it creates erectile dysfunction. All for kinds sure, of stuff. yeah. And then like, and I was also reading into this one. We're like, yeah, you think that, that, that that's the way girls like the way you watch porn. You think that's the way girls want to get banged out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But a lot of girls don't even want that oh, shit, man. dog. They want to be fucking. They want touch, dog. So it's like, yeah, dude. So then it messes you up. Because then you're trying to be like a porn star, but then like, yeah. and then you try or. Or your regular girl that could be amazing doesn't really do it for uh, you because you've been watching so much sick shit. They're just yeah, like, yo, you no, know, that's I get a bit makes about the, that. It makes the it makes the thresh level higher yeah. and higher and higher. Yeah, yeah, it's mess. It's for sure messed up my brain, dog. It's yeah. crazy. I got a bit about it. And it's like uh, a woman can learn everything she needs to learn about how to please a man by watching five minutes of porn. The only thing a man's gonna learn is that if he doesn't pay his bills, his wife's gonna get banged out by five black guys. <laughs> 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 that's really like that's the, yeah that's what you swear it's like in your yeah it's crazy dog yeah it's wild bro no the porn is everything's too it's so easy nowadays yeah like even going to the store and waiting in line is like a long line you got to go to the dmv or something or like you got to go sign up for something if there's a long line you can just be on your phone and be doing literally whatever you're doing at home just on your phone so it's like yeah there's no more um it's like, i feel like it's like when i go now i've been doing that lately like when i'm in a store i try not to take my phone out yeah, I'm just like sit there in my own head and l like let this shit suck. I'm at the line in Aldi's and I'm like, yo, just let this suck. Mm -hmm. Just don't open that goddamn thing because yeah. then you're just gonna blank off into the world. You know what I'm saying? Do you meditate at all? Um, I don't sit down and like, 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 yeah. huh? Like, but I do do yoga. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? I feel like that's a form of meditation. But I feel like when I train and when I do comedy, I feel like that's a form of meditation because yeah. I say that. Um, Whenever my brain is like shutting off your brain, and mm -hmm. it's hard, so I haven't been able to do it solo dolo. You know, it definitely, it definitely is. That's all a form of meditation. Running is a form of meditation. But I like doing like mindfulness meditation because I feel it helps me like get more into with my brain. And that's not like sitting here and being like mm, or anything like that. You just basically sit there, and you're trying to be present. And what you do is like. A lot of people make the mistake and think like, oh, if they have a thought, like that screws the whole thing up. It doesn't. All you got to do is recognize the thought, right? So you're like sitting here, maybe popcorn comes in your head and you'd be like, oh, that's a thought about popcorn. Like, and try to analyze where it came from. You know, if you feel a sensation or like you feel a, um, an itch or anything like that, like just recognize, hey, I feel an itch. And you're basically being mindful about what's going on around you, you know? And you do that for like five minutes a day and like that's a good way of keeping yourself from mindlessly scrolling over shit and like mindlessly turning on the porn, you know. That's a good one. Um, what I've been doing is too is that when I wake up in the morning, I want to add that actually. So like you start with five and then just five minutes. Can I heard, That's what I was reading. I was just listening about somebody saying else, somebody else saying they do this. And then you can like build it up, right? Like go to like 10 minutes, go to 15 minutes, like a little more as you go. Like build mm -hmm. it up more and more yep. to the meditation. Yeah, that's that's a good one, y'all.